G'day, my name's Tom, and I've just had my first dose of the AstraZeneca vaccine, and here's why I think you should have one too. Life in lockdown is hell. I mean, the suicide rate, the domestic violence, the economic hardship in the short and the long term, the loneliness, the just general misery, you know, all things we don't want to see going in the upward direction, right? And I don't care who you blame, whether it's the PM, the Premier, the lockdown, it doesn't matter because we can't turn back time now. But the way forward is with the AstraZeneca vaccine. We have a location in our own country that can make about two and a half million of the vaccines in a week. And we're shipping them overseas. Do, do you understand how mental that is? If we use that place to its full capacity, we could vaccinate our population up to where the UK's first dose was when they got out of lockdown within four weeks. That's no lockdowns, no QR codes, no bans on visiting your mates within four weeks. Now, there's been a lot of talk about blood clotting risks, and that's been blown completely out of the water. And let me explain to you why with the only measurement Australians understand, footy fields. The MCG holds about 100,000 people, and let's just pretend they're all between the ages of 18 to 29. If all 100,000 of them get the vaccine, two of them get a blood clot. Two of them. If the wanker on the megaphone shouted, and two of you are going home with a brand new car, most of us would figure out that there's no real risk of that happening. And let's say that you're somehow unlucky enough to get yourself a blood clot. There's a one in a million chance that you're going to die from a blood clot. You'd have to build nine more MCGs and then pick out one unlucky bugger from 10 of them. Hopefully it's a Collingwood supporter. But let's go back to the first stadium and compare this risk to every other risk in the world because four people in that stadium are gonna die in a car crash. 155 of them are gonna die of cancer. And if every one of them got COVID in that stadium, 10,000 of them are gonna end up in hospital. So do yourself a favor and Google hot dot COVID vaccine and book yourself an appointment today.